to all of you. I have no idea what is going on in this country anymore, but what is going on is so classically 1984 that it is absolutely astounding. I don't know what happened to the journalists. You are not reporting the truth and you're just reporting the official story. And the official story is a lie, and you know it. Start doing your job. To those in my community, wake up to reality. This is toxic. This is toxic. Now, I'm going to present the evidence. Facts. And facts are not opinion. Facts are facts. And there is a lot of facts that support everything that we have been saying. Now, there are so many companies that do weather modification. These are just two. There's many programs that they've been doing for a while. Convective vortex experiments. Um, there are many chemtrail programs, cloud seeding programs in Delaware, in Nevada, um, in virtually every state. Illinois has their weather modification projects, um, as well as Oklahoma. Uh, there are, and all of this information is right on a Google, a five-minute search. Wyoming weather modification. It is amazing to me that you could actually say that we're conspiracy theorists and think that that's like an argument. Look at all of this. North Dakota has a thunderstorm project. Yes, they are creating weather. Northeast sampling program, it's like a poo-poo platter here because we have everything. Texas has their own website, a weather modification website. What is wrong with you that you're not seeing this? Universities are involved, Stanford, Virginia Tech, companies are calling for permanent cloud seeding. This has been going on for decades. And they think these companies, oh, it's great benefit. Let's go forward. Let's do it permanently. Benefit, financial benefit. Colorado wants to extend it. Uh, it you know, there's even a weather modification association. There are laws congressional legislation on weather modification. <laughs> it's been going on so long, there's legal precedent for weather modification law. The first case was in 1950. <laughs> there are many statutes in, in mostly every state. Yeah, it's real. It is very real. So stop silencing the people who are trying to tell you the truth. It's also very dangerous. It's very toxic. And HARP, HARP is real. HARP has a website. Why don't you do some research? And they're going, they have these, you know, oh, uh, frequently asked questions. Well, their answers are not true. They say they don't affect weather. They certainly do. Oh, look at this, owning the weather. Military intelligence. That's an oxymoron. Air Force, let's own the weather by 2025. And here they even have a, a road map. All the years, let's see, let's see, where are we, 2010? Oh, artificial weather. Are they creating artificial weather? There are documents that actually support our conspiracy theory. Oh, look, Harp, it creates earthquakes. The world is trying to wake Americans up. You're in some kind of dreamland. You're not attending to facts, okay? The floods that are occurring in the Midwest and Missouri right now, harp. The, the tornadoes, harp. Mississippi River, you see my pen point? Jesus, enough. This is dangerous, okay? You need to wake up. 
Why did they do the earthquake in Japan? Because Japan was producing cars that don't use gas. Yeah, HARP's a threat, big threat. It's a threat to us. Get that HARP is being used against us. I'm tired, okay? I'm also scared because now everything you have just been silencing, you've just been walking around ignoring what's been going on. It's not okay. What is going on is the Constitution, our country is no longer what you thought it was in your little dream sleep living. It is not the same, okay? Obama has gutted the Constitution. There's, there's so much documentation on all of this. You have to connect the dots, okay? And you need to wake up immediately because it's because of you that we've run out of time. These executive orders that Obama is signing to appoint 10 governors, Homeland Security, FEMA, all of these, everything under his control, this, he's, he's putting the army into the National Guard. Don't you see what's happening? Oh, here, yeah. So if there's a biological attack, guess what? Postal Service is going to deliver the countermeasure with federal law enforcement. It will be mandatory that we get vaccinated. Federal law enforcement. Top secret. Everything's top secret with Obama. So uh, all communications with all of these, Homeland Security, everything, top secret. Why? Because courts do not look at top secret. So the courts do not get involved. You've got to start getting real information. You cannot listen to mainstream media anymore. Understand. That executive order, that was to dis the disestablishment of the joint forces. Look at this map. The earthquake, the New Madrid earthquake, the flooding that is going on in Missouri along the fault line is intentional to create an earthquake here to put in, oh, look at that. Oh, my God, they even put in earthquake. And what's going to happen? Oh, the U.S. North Command, what is that? Hmm. And Homeland Defense, look at that. Ten sections. Could that be the ten governors that he's going to appoint? And look at that. FEMA already has their regions carved out. The most likely mission. You have got to wake up. It is reality. What you have been doing is living in a delusion. We live in reality here. And the reality is, is that you've got to ask questions and do this.